like that to be hit. Hey, my family, where are they? What did you do with my family? Please, man! Just do us both a favor and pretend you're still asleep. I wouldn't start talking if I were you. You're lucky we do things a certain way. I'm already tempted to put a bullet in your brain for what you did to Lonnie back there. If we start talking, I'm gonna get angry. What happened to him was an accident. Yeah, right. Keep talking, we might find ourselves in a similar accident. Jesus Get what I'm Christ. saying? Please, you have to believe me. We were just... Not another word, or God help me, I'll put you to sleep myself. We still got a haul ahead of us, and I'm not about to listen to you. What the heck? Stop! Stop! Oh, shit! Oh, no, no! Ow? God damn it. Oh, fuck. Yeah. All right. That's good. Just keep looking forward. Wait, is that Clem? Look, I'm no threat to you, okay? I surrender. Well, that's obvious. Seeing how you didn't shoot that guy. Clem. Okay. Now don't do anything stupid. Because I'm not as nice as you. I won't hesitate. You're Clementine. Day. Well, wait, did you do that? With the tree? I was trying to stop the truck. Yeah, you stopped it all right. Tree fell slower than I thought it would. Put your hands up and close your eyes. Look, I'm the victim here. We're all victims. Oh, so it's okay for you to rob me? This is payment for saving you. Hey, that's for my niece. She loves chocolate more than anything. Yeah. I promised it to her. Please. Keep your eyes closed and count to a hundred before you go. Wait, just... My family. I need to get back to them. We were attacked and I don't... Look, I just need to know where I am. We were driving down the 522 and that's when we found the junkyard. They're still there. I need to get back to them. I know where that is. You said you were driving? In our van, yeah. I'll take you to the junkyard, if you let me have your van. I get you there in one piece, then I drive away. Yeah, absolutely. You got a deal. Good. Let's go. Great. I this no really longer necessary. have a van. I don't know you, I don't trust you, and I'm not taking any chances. So it's safer for both of us if you're tied up. Look, I get it. You're being cautious. Glad we understand each other. Yeah. The name's Javier, by the way. People call me Javi. Clementine. Yay! Clementine. Cool name. If you say so. I think it's an awesome name. Best name around.
Nice trick. You're good at that. Look, you don't want to talk? Fine. But how about you give me that gun back so I can at least defend myself? For all I'd know, you'd turn around and use it on me. If you give me a weapon, we can protect each other. I give you a weapon, I can't take my eyes off you. At least this way I know what I'm up against. Smart kid. Very, very smart kid. Oh, what there's the herd. The herd caught up with us. Muertos. What do you call them? Walkers. What do you call the ones that run? They're all fucking walkers, okay? Look, Jesus. I'm just... I'm not used to being around other people. Not for a while, anyway. Usually, it's just me on my own. Apology accepted. I wasn't apologizing. Of course not. There's still no time so, to never apologize. Who's at this junkyard? My brother's kids. And his wife. It's impressive. Surviving this long. Not sure how you did it. Just keeping everyone together like that. Well, I didn't do it alone. My, uh, well, uh, Kate helped. She did most of the work, actually. Sounds nice. Having a partner. It is. Well, how about you? You must have been pretty young when this shit started. I was. But some people looked out for me, too. What happened to them? Oh, God. Same thing that happens to everyone. Shit. We can't stay here. There's a town up ahead. We can stay there until the herd passes. Otherwise, we're walker food. Fine. Whatever you say. Thank you. Don't make me regret this. Come on! Yay! Let's go! Let's go! Come on! Let's Seed. One of these days, those doors are going to close, and your ass will be on the other side. <laughs> yeah, and when that day comes, Trip, I promise I'll eat you first. Damn, it's Clementine, right? You staying a while this time? No. Once the walkers pass, I'm taking this guy to a junkyard off the highway. My family might be trapped there, hiding from some very bad dudes. Well, shit. I'm truly sorry to hear that. This herd rolled in pretty quick. We're hoping it's gone just as fast. So, just keep your heads down and steer clear of trouble. You got me? Sure. There's too much going on outside the walls tonight. We'll be cool. Just need a place to ride out the herd, that's all. All right. I'm gonna hold you to that. And I wouldn't recommend changing your mind if you wanna hang on to all your teeth, that is. Why does everyone want to hit me? God! Well, 
Welcome to Prescott. Hey, yeah, hey, hey. people just want to hit me today, man. It's a pretty cool place, actually. Built from an old airstrip, I guess. The people, on the other hand, not so much. Not my favorite. Usually, I'm in and out as quick as I can manage. Not exactly an option this time, though. It's just a pit stop, okay? We're gone as soon as there's a window. I hope that window comes soon. In the meantime... Hey, Javi. What's... what's up? My family... They're still out there. If you guys made it this long, I I'm sure you know... You'll know what to do. Hopefully. Clementine's always such a Let's nice go. person, this way. man. I gotta see a guy about some bullets. Jeez, I haven't been in a place like this since, well, you know, it's just like the old days. Listen, I gotta take care of something. Hang tight. Wait, wait. What should I do? I don't know. Why don't you make some friends? Mm, sounds about right. I wonder where they found this old thing. I haven't seen one of these in years. Excuse me. Oh, you again. <laughs> you got some moves, I'll give you that. Hold on a minute. Don't I note you from somewhere? Do we? I don't know. Maybe. Garcia. Javier Garcia. For what it's worth, I think you got screwed on the gambling thing. A lifetime ban. Shit. Should have had a 20-year career. The way I see it, nothing wrong with betting on yourself to win. Honestly, I don't even think about it anymore. The past is the past. <laughs> Fair enough. Anyway, I'm Conrad. This here's Francine. He runs the place? I just take his money. <laughs> yeah, well, maybe I'm just letting you win. Oh, actually, if you're the gambling type, game's poker. Five card stud. I'll raise you. What do you think? Should I call? Should I fold? Hmm. Don't get too intimidated. I lose more often than I care to admit. Hmm. Fold. It doesn't feel right. Mm, go with your gut. Fold. Now that's a shame. Let's see how it could have gone. You folded that. <laughs> Unbelievable. God damn it. What Shit, the fuck? <laughs> Talk about dodging a bullet. Thanks wow. for calling. Can't afford to lose anymore. Let me get you a drink for the assist. On the house. Ooh. Bottoms up. Wow, man, this smells like turpentine. <laughs> <laughs> That's the weak stuff. Don't turn oh, away shit. from me. I'm talking to you. Oh, shit. Hey, what's the point in talking when I already told you a deal is a deal? And it's done. What's going on? This guy ripped me off. I traded him a crate of perfectly good batteries. And he gave me a box of bullets that won't fire. He could have gotten both of us killed. Oh, yeah? And who the fuck are you, a bodyguard or something? She doesn't need one. Because I don't scare easy, all right? She doesn't need a bodyguard. She can take care of herself. Believe me. Uh, well, you can't even prove those are the bullets I traded you. Oh, hey, Clint, come on. He knows the bullets don't work. Listen to him. He's not even nervous. I could have died because of his bullets. Unfucking believable. Look out! <laughs> Hey, 
Listen, let's all cool down, huh? You were acting crazy, I was too. We just got a little out of hand. That's all. Just give me what I'm owed. Jesus, you gotta get her under control, man. This ain't no way to do business. Boy, you have it wrong, buddy. I don't control her, which looks like bad news for you. He had a deal. All right, hey, okay, all right, so, hey, we'll, we'll trade back. I'll find some batteries. I don't need batteries. What I need are bullets that won't get me killed. Oh. <gasps> oh, no. Oh, no. Drop uh, the gun! Shit. Right now! See, he attacked you and that he was going for his gun. I fucking warned you! Eli attacked him. I only shot because... Shut it! You done enough talking. Drop it. There's a herd out there and you're firing off a fucking... What the fuck happened here? He attacked Hobby, okay? It was self-defense. Enough from you. Did she really have to shoot? Look at my eye, man. Of course she's telling the truth. The guy ripped her off, reached for his gun, and would have shot me if she hadn't stopped him. See? You happy now? <sighs> God damn it. I'm putting you two under lock and key until I figure out what to do with Whoa. you. Oh, hey, what? Are you for real? As real as it gets. Now move it. God damn That's it. That's some nerve coming in and fucking up my bar. What the fuck, dude? Oh, you guy. This is some bullshit. I oughta punch your fucking lights out. Both of ya. But Eli was a grade A certified dipshit. I'll even have someone come take a look at that cut. Hey. Thanks for having my back at the hangar. That was, um... That was cool of you. I wasn't sure there for a minute. Of course. Anytime. I don't mean you and I are a team now. Thanks. I mean it. Yay. Just don't think this makes us friends or anything. Hello? Hello. I'm Eleanor. I'm what passes for a doctor around here. The trip sort of overdoes it sometimes. I hate that I'm treating you in a cage, like you're some feral animal. Javier. Pleasure's all mine. Is it now? Now, let's see about that wound. Yeah, he got you good. Try to hold still. <clears throat> Why is it always the pretty ones who end up causing the most trouble? As if good looks equal bad behavior or something. <sighs> I've never understood it. Yeah. It takes one to know one. Well, it takes one to know one. One what? One pretty troublemaker. <laughs> I'll give you that one. People are saying she killed a man in cold blood. If you don't mind me asking, what did happen exactly? That they were arguing and that she went crazy over nothing? Look, things got out of hand. Clementine was only trying to make a point, but then... You make it sound so casual. Because it was. Best thing is probably for you two to leave town and get back to your group. We were attacked earlier this evening. There were four of us. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. If there's. If there's anything I can do to help. Not, well, not that I have here. much to offer you, but I know a thing or two about losing family. I wouldn't want to make any trouble for you. This whole thing's been pretty messy. I hear you. But totally. Eleanor, you done yet? Just about. All right, here's what we're gonna do. I'm driving you that junkyard myself. Get you out of my hair, and no one can say I didn't do right by no one. In the meantime, you two can sleep right here and think about what shitheads you were earlier. On my terms and on my timeline. You got me? All right. Fine. Fair enough. Fair enough? 
Go kiss a skunk's ass. I should be earning a goddamn Boy Scout badge for this. Trip, it doesn't seem right to wait. Javi's people, they could need a medic. No, nah, no way. Not putting you in that kind of danger again. That's not your call. Damn. Look, maybe there's another way. We've got a rear gate down at the other end of the airfield. We don't use it much, but, well, we could leave tonight. Slip past the herd, get a jump start on reaching that junkyard. Something tells me Trip won't be too happy about you sneaking us out the back door. He'll get pissy, but he'll get over it. Sometimes with him, you gotta ask for forgiveness rather than permission. Anyway, think about it. I've got to check on some patients, but I'll be back in an hour. You know, I never would have guessed she had it in her. Yeah, she's... she's something. The thing is, is, and maybe this sounds weird, but I still trust Trip more than I trust her. Oh, this is a tough one. I don't know guys, I really want to go see my family again, but then I really want to be on a good side with Clem. You're right, Trip's got more muscle, just in case. We'll wait, and get a ride with him. Glad you're finally listening to reason. You know, when I met you, I thought you'd just be another asshole like everyone else. And to think that when we first met, you nearly blew my head off. <laughs> yeah, guess I made the right call. It's gonna be a while before that herd passes. We might as well get some sleep. Good idea. I'm exhausted. I'll get the lamp. Ooh. Flashback? AJ, we're gonna starve. I'm starving. We gotta... AJ, stay here while I find us dinner, okay? Uh, Tell me you understand. Uh, <sighs> Come on, don't you want dinner? Mmm, dinner. Oh, God. 
Ow. No, thank you. No, thank you at all. I don't need that in my life. Oh. I know what that feels like, too. It sucks. Ugh, I'm good. I am so good. Oh, shit, there's a lost Hey, Clay. We almost there. Hey, Clem. Yeah, we're close. I gotta say, I hope your people are safe and sound. Eleanor asked me before we left to make sure of it. Oh, yeah? Yes, sir. So that's what I'm gonna do. So why she went to bat for you, I've got no idea. I mean, she hardly even knows you. And you don't know her, for that matter. You know, there's not much mystery to it, Trip. She's a good human being. Yeah. Eleanor's got a big heart. That's for damn sure. Guys, that's the place. Oh, shit. What a mess. Damn. Jesus. Must have been hundreds of them. Kate's good in a crisis. She'd know how to get shelter. What's that? Hey. I just listen to what you said. Lock yourself in and don't come out. Not even once it's quiet. It kept running through my head like on a loop. Did they hurt you? Are you okay? I hid before they could get to me. I'm fine. Really. Kate and your brother, where are they? We got pulled apart when that huge bunch of muertos showed up. Kate yelled that they were going to try to make it back to the van. Then that's where we're headed. Let's go find your brother, sweetheart. Oh, no. No sign of them. They must have seen it like this, then gone someplace else to hide. Kate. They're trapped in there. Mariana, stay back. Alright, time to fuck some people up. After you. I swear I did. You don't have to snot all over my shirt about it. I thought we were dead. Like, never gonna see you again dead. We only had a couple bullets left. You're still alive, aren't you? So is Kate. So is Mari. That's all that matters. I was just so scared. I'm here now. You don't have to be scared. Yay! No more scared. Hey, you hurt yourself. You must have scraped it in the truck. Didn't even notice. Hey, at least it's not a bite. No, not much we can do about it here. I've got a lady friend who's a doctor. As soon as we get back to Prescott, she'll patch you right up. I'm Trip, by the way. Pleasure to make your acquaintance. 
We should be getting back. Don't want to push her luck. Yeah. Who's the kid with the gun? She have a name you want to share with us? She saved my life. Pulled this crazy stunt. Let me get the upper hand on the asshole who took me away from you guys. Her name's Clementine. Hi there. Glad I was able to help. Well, we're very grateful to you. Really. There's a town nearby. It's safe. I like the sound of that. Yay. Oh my god. Javi, do they have hot water? Even, like, lukewarm water would be okay. Ugh, oh, and bubble bath. Wouldn't bubble bath be amazing? Eh, don't get your hopes up too high. It's a nice place, but it's not the Ritz. Well, whatever they've got, I'm sure it's gonna be great. Between you and me, these kinds of missions don't usually go so well. But you found every single one of your people. And you found them alive, healthy, reasonably cheerful. It's a hell of a thing. Don't think so. Now let's wait to celebrate until we're back behind the walls, okay? I don't want to jinx us. Well, some things are worth saying woohoo about, that's all. When we get back to Prescott, you still owe me a working ride. I haven't forgotten about our deal. You couldn't have known what happened to your van, but still, I need some way out of here. I was hoping you might stay. You know, considering... Considering what? You came all the way out here with me. Yeah, for the van, not for... Cool. Yeah, you just want her headphones, too. Thanks. Ah! They start shooting again. Wall. I'm gonna fucking kill him. I'm gonna kill all of them. You wanna die too? You think that's gonna help your little girl? So what? I'm just supposed to let him live? If you wanna do what's right for your family, you'll come with me. It's time to go, man. We stay here and we finish this. Are you fucking nuts? We gotta get the fuck out of here I right now. I already killed one of you. If we don't stop them, they're gonna come after your family again. Let Trip help them. You stay with me. What? No, uh, Javi, you have to come with us. Javi, please. Trust me, Javi. We have to end this now. No, Javi, Stand and please fight, come with motherfucker. Us. Get her back to Prescott. We'll cover you. Javi, go with them. I'll be fine. Give me a hand here, kid. Just keep firing until they're out of sight, okay? I'm ready. God. Uh. What?
Okay, so we headed back on the road. I left the driver alone. How is there not a way to get locked up? Alright guys, well, that's the end of part one of episode one. I think, that I don't know exactly, but uh, thank you guys very much for watching. I really do hope you enjoyed. Uh, like if you liked. Uh, for those of you who are new, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. And uh, yeah, I'm Hopeful Survivor. Peace out, my survivors. Remember, always stay positive. Do you see? Oh, 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 oh,